What's up, you guys? It's Matt here. So most of you know how I feel about what's going on with Shibirium, the ecosystem dev team, and Shiba Inu, and how we're really trying to separate things. Well, articles that are coming out, consistently coming out, talking about how Shibirium is going to have a large impact on Shiba Inu is not really helping, right? It's not really helping the cause and what we're just trying to do and bring the community to be a major part of this, to be the biggest part of it that really impacts SHIB. And that's really what we want to see is the impact for this project. If we see impacts for other things that are in an ecosystem surrounding SHIB, that's understandable. But we want to see the impact for SHIB in everything that is built within this community, right? So um, this video is kind of a weird subject, right? five Shibirium features that will keep SHIB below 0 0.00001. So I can see that I have an article out here and you probably already have seen the article um, to where it's Shibirium features that could push SHIB above 0 0.001 or 10% of a penny. Now, um, they're just trying to fish for some um, you know, Shiba Inu holders that are believing in both of these areas, Shib, um, you know, Shibirium, the price movement, the community, all of that stuff. And they're just trying to gather them to, to kind of give great news for Shibirium. But in fact, they're not really giving us anything but the same thing that we already know. So before we get started in this, make sure you guys hit the like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell for more videos like this one. Also, make sure you check out some of the links down below. It does help out the channel. And if you want to check out my uh, my kick, my kick link is down below. I'm going to stream a lot more on kick today. I did a sold live stream on kick because I didn't really have time to go on YouTube. So I felt as though I would just do a kick live stream. So if you want to join me on those, which you do get notifications through the app and through email, feel free to go and follow me over there. I've heard people having trouble following. So if you are having issues hitting the follow button and it just disappears, you know, continue to try again. I know that may be a pain, um, but definitely do it once you do get um, to actually follow, then you'll get all the notifications and, and the benefits there. So uh, thank you anyways for taking the time to do anything. <clears throat> but if you could take some time to hit that like button while I was going through that spiel. Um, but let's go ahead and talk about uh, Shibirium or sorry, Shiba Inu first. Uh, Shiba Inu is currently at a level of 0 0.00007, right below the level of 0 0.00001. Um, we're seeing it at a $4.4 billion market cap with $75 million worth of volume. Popularity is not really at its highest right now. And you know, of all the things that are going on, there was so much that happened within this last month or so with the conference and, you know, Shitoshi talking about what he talked about with the things that he's selling, as well as the launch of Shibirium and then the relaunch of Shibirium. And then to find out that Shibirium is not going to be burning as much as we thought it was going to burn. Um, and the fact that burns are not the end all be all coming straight from Shitoshi, right? That's just not something I like to see or hear, but I see after putting out all these videos, trying to kind of separate the two, you see articles like this, right? Five Shibirium features that could push SHIB above, um, you know, 10% of a penny. And again, these type of articles are the things that keep SHIB and the ecosystem together. And the same thing with videos and the same thing with, you know, uh, tweets and or, or whatever you want to call them at this point. Um, so this is the article and as they go through it, you're going to see some of the things that we have already known that Shibirium has done, right? It's not a new feature, improved transaction speeds, saying that um, transaction speeds for Shiba Inu will be slow and seeing the, the improved transaction speeds are going to be amazing for Shiba Inu as a whole. While um, that is something that's amazing for any cryptocurrency, it also means that people would need to move over to Shibirium in order to get those faster transaction speeds, which I would imagine in a lot of layer two, um, you know, systems, a lot of layer two platforms, you're going to see the ability to trade all, you know, Ethereum projects as time goes on. So it's going to, um, you know, definitely speed up those transaction speeds. So that's not something that's going to bring more, more of a price movement to Shiba Inu at all. Um, we knew that that was coming. That's not something that has, um, you know, ever changed. Also, the reduced fees is another thing that will, that they claim will create a, a higher price uh, position. But honestly, it's not. It's, 
is this a reason why you would move your Shiba Inu over to Shibarium? No, right? You may open up a wallet or, or link your wallet to Shibarium, but that doesn't mean that you're going to move your Shiba Inu um, and, you know, uh, migrate your Shiba Inu and convert your Shiba Inu, do whatever you have to do. That's not the reason that you're going to do it. You may add your wallet again, but that's pretty much it. Token utility. This is the, the only thing. These two right here are the only things that I can see any type of uh, push for, but it all depends, right? If people and businesses are actually going to build and use, um, you know, Shibarium, token utility and a D app development, yes, will be a big thing, but that's only if we're going to see massive amount of, of building. Right now, we do not have a ton of DEX volume on any position, right? Not just Shiba Inu, but Ethereum or, or um, you know, looking at ADA or, or um, just trying to figure out token um, symbols and token names right now. But either way, you're not seeing things that are created on that side. We even have the example of Terra Luna Classic where so much was happening on the DEX side, we were looking to build so much. And even though we were trying to build so much, there were there were different people and businesses that were trying to do something bigger. We still lost a ton of volume on the DEX side and we're seeing all volume on the CEX side. So even though you're seeing that, that's not where the money is. That's not where the transactions will happen, which means we're not gonna see those burns. And then we're talking about how you um, own ecosystem. Lastly, Shibarium also focuses on constructing, um, uh, you know, Shiba Inu ecosystem. <clears throat> uh, this ecosystem uh, encompasses diverse projects, Shib the Metaverse, Shiba Swap, um, decentralized exchange, DEX, and blockchain games. Uh, anticipate anticipated to draw users and foster engagement. The Metaverse and games. Uh, complemented by the the DEX enhanced uh, liquidity uh, catered to traders. This comprehensive ecosystem approach can potentially uh, cultivate a and expand the Shiba Inu community, um, elevating it beyond mere meme coin status. That is definitely not something, or it's something that could happen if they would find a way to implement Shiba Inu within it, but they have been proven to not implement anything within that. So. All of these things, in my opinion, are going to keep things below the level of 0 0.00001 instead of keeping it above or seeing it propel above the level um, or excel above the level of 0 0.001, right? 10% of a penny. I don't think that that will happen because of Shibarium. I think it will happen because of the community, not because of what they are building, right? Everything that they have built has not been tied to Shiba Inu at all. And while we see that, um, we're starting to kind of open our eyes to what the real focus is. And that's just to develop something that can make them money. That's all it is. So these things are not it. Articles like these are not it. So guys, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell for more videos like this one. Um, also, make sure you check out some of the links down below. It does help out the channel. I'm going to get out of here and I'll catch you guys in the next one. See ya.